going on guys welcome back it's been a minute it's been a long long while actually um how you guys been um i hope you guys are doing fine um i'm doing really good um staying healthy and all that good stuff i hope so, so yeah um i actually just got done getting a haircut um uh, hope you guys are doing good i haven't been recording much because there isn't anything to do with this lockdown so i don't want to like show you guys like me watching netflix like every day um but yeah um today's thursday may 7th um and yeah i just wanted to get on check in with you guys make sure or just talk to you guys for a little bit um let you guys know what's going on um maybe just telling you guys that i'm good um and slowly we'll slowly start making more videos um and that's all i have for you guys i guess um hope you guys stay safe and yeah i'll catch you guys up later bye Okay, haircut time. All right, and we're back. Um, just finished up that haircut. Everything was good. So so glad to be getting haircuts now. Oh, let me fix this a little bit. Uh, right now I'm about to go get some Starbucks because I'm low on energy. I don't know if that's a good idea though, because um, it's like 2:30, so I don't know if there's gonna be a lot of traffic or not. But I haven't gotten any caffeine for today like zero since the morning so i'm really craving a starbucks i'm gonna go get a monster and energy drink but i don't have a mask on or anything and i don't feel like getting down so drive through through starbucks it is so we're gonna go do that hi welcome to starbucks what can i get started for you hi uh can i just get a venti uh venti ice white mocha venti ice white mocha is the whip so in there oh uh, yeah that's fine Already, anything else for you? Uh, that would be it. Alright, it's gonna be 589 at the window. Cool, thank you. Um, y'all see me get a little nervous there? Um, yeah, um, I haven't picked you guys up. I've noticed that so far I've only picked you guys up when I'm going to get a haircut, so, uh, nice. I don't know, it's hella hot outside. It's very hot outside. Um, we're having good weather. Uh, actually, Monday and Tuesday were pretty cloudy. Monday, I think it rained. Which was really random but that's that colorado weather um but right now we're having really really good weather it's hot um it's supposed to get hotter next week so right now we're like in the 70s or so but yeah um i really like this weather i like hot weather better than cold weather for sure yeah that's all we got for right now just getting my starbucks um hope you guys are doing well like i've said before um yeah i don't know what else to tell you guys but yeah um I've been good um, on the topic of working out. I really haven't. Um, it's mainly when I feel like it, which is almost like I'm not gonna say it's never, but like it's every now and then. It's not as consistent as I should be, but I just can't do these at home workouts. You know, pretty whack. I th they're just ex those are just excuses for myself. But um, basically, when the gym starts to open again, it's gonna be like a fresh slate. I'm looking forward to it because I haven't been to the gym in like forever along with like everybody else as well But like I feel like what's gonna happen is like New Year's again where the, the gyms are just packed constantly At all times of the day because everyone's just like well Let's go to the gym because that's what we're gonna do now But um, yeah, we'll see what happens when that all starts to happen um, Not too worried about it right now, but Yeah, I can't wait for the gyms to be open and the Starbucks. I'm really tired, actually. I don't know if you guys can tell. Um, but yeah, that's all I got. Nothing has really changed. Um, pretty normal. Watch a lot of Netflix. That package that you guys saw that I got yesterday. Um, you guys will probably see it in later videos. Um, it was just not really that important, but you guys will see it around. I could drink these Starbucks drinks pretty fast. I get the venti. Always venti. Anything smaller than a venti, I don't think it's worth. I don't think it's like I just get Starbucks. I don't know uh, anything below venti, not worth it. Um, that's what I personally think. I go through these drinks like in a five seconds. Like I'm about to show you guys right now because <sighs> because I'm really low on caffeine. That's I feel like if I just chug like like a monster, like some Starbucks drink, um, 
that's the best way to get caffeine for myself like just get this get the spike that i need to get going i don't like to just like drink it as like i go throughout my day because that makes it like watery and icy and stuff and i don't like that i just rather get all the flavors all in once just chomp, as fast as i can not as fast as i can like i enjoy it but like i drink it pretty fast because it's not like a lot of liquid so yeah that's how i be drinking my stuff i don't even wear my hats like this but i think i'm still wearing my hats yeah do you guys like tuck this in here or do you guys just like let it hang i think it's pretty cool when you just let it hang <laughs> and we're waiting for this drink hi hi we got the thing Anyways, y'all have a good one. We got our Starbucks. Mm. Caffeine is amazing. I love this stuff. All right, bye. All right, bad, bad, bad. What is going on, guys? Welcome to today, whatever today is. I think today's Thursday, the 21st. That was a little random clip of a backpack that I've been waiting for since like April and in February, March. Yeah, April um from anaka power um it's a really cool backpack i like it a lot the interior is like yellow silk um i got it why did i get a backpack because i missed the gym and that's gonna be my new gym backpack so yeah excited to try that out it's just like little things like that that like make me <laughs> miss the gym a lot more since this video has been a little bit short like a lot shorter than usual um i decided to go ahead and do a little q a so these questions i came up with myself because yeah, this is maybe stuff that you guys ask yourselves and stuff, and probably information that you guys might want to know. So, I don't know, maybe not, you probably don't care, but I'm doing it. But, um, here we go, let's get into it. Oh, I didn't worry. My bad, guys, I'm a little rusty because I haven't been doing it that often. So, here we go. Let's start off, um, what is my name? My full name is Manuel Isaac Dominguez, um... Yeah, um, mainly just a lot of people call me Manny. Um, that's what I feel like a lot of people call me. So that's just my whole name. I'm 21 years old. I uh, just turned 21 in March of this year. Um, kind of stuck with the whole pandemic, but it's whatever. Um, still blessed to have seen another year in my life. So really thankful for that. A 5'11 body weight, I would say, is between 180... 175 to like 185 i'm somewhere in there i think i hope um i've never really been that heavy in my life before so um i'm excited to step on a scale and see how like actually how much i do weigh because i feel like right now i'm pretty heavy like i don't feel heavy but i'm i know that i am heavy because just what i've been doing I i've just because i've been eating and not like exercising i guess you could say so i know i'm gonna be pretty heavy once i step on the scale but um i'm already like being prepared for it so it's not gonna shock me once i do step on the scale and if and if i for whatever reason step on the scale and i am lighter than i was before i'll be a little upset because i'm kind of hoping for heavier that way we have more to work with instead of skinnier or not skinnier instead of not as heavy instead of being like not that heavy which just means which is okay um but i think i'd rather have i'd rather work with more weight than with less weight you know what i'm saying um but it is what it is i'll let you guys know how much i weigh whenever i do weigh myself current goals gym wise um not able to go to the gym so right now i'm trying to maintain my physique um slowly bulking right um obviously i'm not working out well okay honestly not really working out right now so that's that i'm gonna be straight up with you guys um i haven't been working out so yeah i've just been bulking like eating um which isn't ideal because we wanted to maximize our strength grow our overall physique so um i guess we are growing overall um our weight is going up i do feel like like you can't really tell but um maybe my face is a little chubbier i don't know um definitely have i'm holding on to a lot more fat on my waist i guess you could say that's where i and my back my lower back that's where i've noticed that i tend to hold on to the most fat um my legs i feel like they're a little bit bigger it's not because i'm working out obviously it's because i guess i'm getting some of my fat to, to my legs which i'm actually really thankful for because my legs are really really tiny in my opinion so um whatever size we could bring to that 
um, it is definitely gonna help bring the growth overall when we do go back to training, right? Uh, like I said, I haven't been working out during this pandemic, um, which is okay. Um, personally, I'm just taking the time to back off the weight. Food um, intake hasn't been the best. Well, it has. I eat all my meals, right? Um, macros, I haven't been keeping track of that or any of that. Just I eat. I don't try to like eat a bunch of fast food like three times a day and stuff like that. Um, I try to avoid that, but yeah, that's not very hard to avoid. Just cook at home if you are working out during this pandemic to be able to maintain your strength and the muscle that you have gained um i recommend getting at least one gram of protein per pound of weight so let's say for example my weight is 175 pounds i want to at least be getting 175 grams of protein in order to maintain the muscle that we have gained already or we currently have right so if so that's my tip to you guys if you guys are working out and you guys aren't able to go to the gym but you're still looking to maintain your muscle right you don't want to lose what you have worked for so yeah um one gram of protein per pound of body weight uh, a lot of talking right here so also supplements i'm not really taking su supplements due to the fact that i haven't been training um but like i just said um protein may make sure you're hitting your protein intake um yeah i don't know if you want to take pre-workout during your home workout be my guest do whatever you need to do to help you get through it um so yeah keep pushing hard i guess thoughts about how when we go back to the gym um obviously i'm gonna be not i'm i'm not going to be as strong um obviously i have probably lost some muscle and some strength but um since there's this thing called muscle memory and it actually is an actual thing um it'll be easier to recover the muscle and strength um pretty fast uh once we do go back to training um we just need to focus on hitting our macros and training hard and once we start training again all the all the strength and all the muscle will come back um faster than you think it will so i'm not too worried i'm a little worried because i'm wasting time right so i'm not prior not maximizing the time that i have right now to be growing my physique but it's okay um accepting the consequences it is what it is i'm trying to use use this time off to the best of my ability to put on some size even if it's all not all muscle i'm thankfully healthy uh my family's doing fine um how could uh yeah i'm overall i'm very in a sound position uh thankfully so really grateful for that things that i miss um that are things that i probably miss i miss going to the gym obviously i miss going to chipotle I haven't had Chipotle because that's like gym and Chipotle kind of tied in together. So I don't want to like, I don't know. I don't want to mix it too. I don't know. I don't think it'd be cool. Like, I don't know. Weird. I miss Chipotle. One thing I'm going to do for sure once all this is over, uh, I'll go get ice cream. And I'm going to go to the gym. Going to the mall, hanging out with my friends, going out to eat at like actual places instead of having to bring everything home. Even though I'm like, I really, really enjoy like going out, getting drive through food and then just come back home and eating but i do occasionally go out and eat at restaurants with my friends and have a good time and all that good stuff so that's something i definitely miss am i a morning person or like a, a night owl um i try to be both like i wish i would be both but i feel like it's really hard like waking up early is not my thing i have like a lot of alarms set up and sometimes i even set up through like I sleep through all those alarms sometimes. So I feel like if I have to get up early, I will do it. But like, I wish I was like those people that only used one alarm. And then just with that one alarm, they would be up. I have to put it like a thousand alarms on to help me get up early in the morning, which is really, really bad and not responsible. But we're working on it somehow. Um, I'm gonna be able to be one of those people that only has one alarm and wakes up in the morning. Just, I think it's just about getting a routine, honestly. But um, night owl, uh, I think I, it's pretty easy for me to stay up late. I do it a lot, actually, which is not that good because sleep is important. But um, I guess I wouldn't consider myself a night owl because it's just something that I regularly do. So it's just what I do, stay up late, which is not ideal. Get your sleep, eight hours of sleep or more. I wish I was both. I try to have, I would think, I would like to, I would... I like to think that I'm a okay balance of both, but I definitely do enjoy sleeping. So, yeah, I don't know. I'm gonna say I'm both, but only when I want to, not all the time, you know? What's my favorite color? I like the color black and white and gray. 
I'm wrapping this up. Hope you guys enjoyed this little Q&A. Um, hopefully next time we do this, it'll be you guys asking the questions and I'll just answer them instead of me like choosing some questions and answer them for you guys. Um, maybe that'll make it easier. Um, if you guys like the video, I'm not going to do that. Um, thank you guys for watching. If you made it this far into the video, I appreciate you guys. Stay safe. And, and yeah, that's it. That's all I got for you guys. Thank you guys for watching. Bye.